Castrol had been on a six-month global journey to produce a documentary that captures the fascinating science behind Castrol Magnatech. It has taken them across the world. And this is the story of how it all came to life. When you look at oil, the problem with oil is you just can't tell that it makes any difference and you can't tell that an oil is any better than any other because it's inside the engine. Now the brilliance of Magnatech is actually you can see it, you can feel the difference that it makes. So we've got the story there. The basic challenge is quite simple. We just need to bring that to life in the best way that we can. Well, the idea of a documentary film came from meeting the scientists that are actually responsible for developing Castrol Magnatech. I mean, you know, these guys are really, really quite inspirational. And sort of creating a story that put them at the heart of it um, we thought was the best way of doing justice to telling the story of the incredible science behind Castrol Magnatech. One of the big challenges for the team was to convey the staggering amount of damage caused to cars by engine wear. So the team travelled to Cape Town, South Africa, where they worked with one of the world's best sand sculptors to create a life-sized car using metallic sand to represent engine dust. The sheer size of the task meant it was no easy feat. You have to pre-plan this, all your logistics, your measurements, and you've got to plan it like a chess game. But all the hard work was definitely worth it, because when the sculpture was unveiled, it soon began to draw the crowds and convey with stark simplicity the real problem of engine wear. Back in the UK, Another team was hard at work creating another striking construction. To illustrate just how difficult it is for oil to cling to metal, the team built a 50-foot polished steel climbing wall clad with real car parts, the first of its kind in the world. In the documentary, we challenge one of the world's leading climbers, Leo Holding, to replicate the same clinging powers as Castrol Magnatech, a test he certainly didn't underestimate. Most surfaces that you climb on tend to be higher friction. Rock, for example, is, is more like sandpaper and it's much easier to grip to. Climbing on a smooth surface like metal is really it's a bit more of a challenge because there's really there's no there's nothing to keep hold of. The result is a stunning piece of footage that symbolizes Castrol Magnatech's unique ability to stick to metal. With all films, there's quite a lot of technical research going on behind the actual filming. Um, for example, within the documentary, we wanted to show the where and actually highlight this, and we did it through 3D animation, 3D modelling and rendering. Into sort of the design of the climbing wall and the build of it, it all had to be done out in CAD, so it was, it was all sort of built in the computer first, and we had to work out the balance of it, where it could actually be built, the size of it, where which studio could actually take a structure of that size, and then obviously how do you light it, how do you get the cameras 60 foot in the air, who can climb it, and then all the, obviously all the health and safety that goes along with, with such a project. For safety and legal reasons, the climber was wearing a harness and rope, but to add drama back into the film, we removed these in post-production. When you see the film itself, it's, it's the stuff that goes on behind the, the scenes is, is always as interesting almost, you know, for, for a filmmaker as, as the actual film itself. The scientists behind Castrol Magnatech feature prominently in the documentary, explaining how they created the innovative, intelligent molecules that give Castrol Magnatech its amazing clinging ability. It's really impressive to see how relentless Castrol scientists are in the pursuit of a solution. And quite simply, we wanted to represent that conviction that they have in developing an engine oil that can cling to metal surfaces and protect your engine at all times. I'm very pleased with this story. I think it's a good story and, and I think we're all very happy here that we've been able to work on technologies that bring these kind of advantages straight away. 
Perhaps the most important people featured in the film are the real drivers and mechanics from three continents who are seen experiencing the tangible benefits of Castrol Magnatech. It all helps build a fascinating picture of how the science behind Castrol Magnatech is making a difference to drivers across the world. Watch it online now on our website and on YouTube.